to existence that I'd like to discuss about it. There was a group of five students in an university in America, which was led by Mark Zuckerberg. And they were given a task, a project work that was to be furnished within 16 days. Uh, then one of the friends in their group felt about developing a technique through which they can communicate even being at their house, not only in the university. Later on, Mark Zuckerberg came into thinking of that and thought about developing a software, a small communicating software through which five of them could communicate being at home and work out for their project work. And later, he developed a small software through which only those five people used to communicate. Later on, their friends, out of, the, out, of the, out of them, out of those five, also wanted to join them in that group. And that came into the existence of the Facebook, which has been used by the whole world today. And of course, Facebook was established in 2004, February 4. 2004, February 4 by Mark Zuckerberg, officially. But that was already established as a small communicating software before three years. And today's few of the countries are there, which has banned the Facebook, thinking about its misuse and disadvantages in the country, and has developed their own social networking sites so that they can have the revenue 